Hey nerds, Sage is here. So I was asked to do this real quick, and since today is kind of just nothing's happening, I can't, I can't, you know, do a summoning session just yet. Things are going a little weird for me. <laughs> it's just how it is. Um, you know, I figured I would just take the time to talk to you guys about a few things. And also, I was asked to do Lloyd, you know, in Infernal, on Armored Mode to show how it is because I was asked to. So I figured I would show you how I did it with my armor emblem team. This is mostly for Laharl who wanted me to, or at least wanted to see how I did. So here you go, Laharl. And in the meantime, we're gonna talk about a few things, mostly when it comes to the rhythm game. And I figured <laughs> there were a lot of opinions all over the place. Some of you enjoyed it, some of you didn't. Some of you found it kind of disappointing. Others found it strangely satisfying. I found it really satisfying and I don't like rhythm games, <laughs> but that might be because it's me. Um, but still, Nonetheless, when it comes to this, what what did you expect? Uh, I guess um, there is one thing that I can have when it comes to a takeaway to this, and I will talk about that in a second. But uh, for now, I just wanted to put this out there and just talk to you guys about it. So let me just get through this real quick, because the one takeaway I had was basically I uh, I enjoyed it a lot and I have fun with it, and I've been trying to do a bit better on the harder difficulties. I haven't moved on to hard expert yet, because I'm terrible at the, at the thing, but, uh, yeah, I, I wanted to, you know, see how well it would, went. yeah, I don't know, how well it would go, but, um, yeah, it, it's, it's a little bit odd. There's this one takeaway that I have from it that just kind of bothers me, and hopefully we're, okay, so as you can see, we're on difficulty hard and expert, and when you just click on that, um, if you've already gone through the mode on easy casual, it just says the stage has already been cleared on a different mode or difficulty and no rewards are available. Uh, or no reward is available, I guess. Still, nonetheless, I feel this is kind of a kind of a little saddening. It's not something terrible, but that was my only takeaway from it was, oh, so if I do the really hard versions of it, I don't really get much out of it, which for me, I'm fine with it's not a big deal like I understand that um, I'm not great at this game and I'm probably never going to be able to actually do the rhythm version of it you know like the rhythm I'm not good at rhythm games at all so chances of me actually getting past expert hard are slim to none but I still feel that maybe you know maybe it might be a good idea to put some emphasis on you know helping out those people who or letting those players who are good at this kind of thing shine a little bit more that's just my feeling on it, and again, coming from a guy who, you know, found the game mode fun, doesn't, I don't really think it's going to be amazing <laughs> in any regard, but it's fun nonetheless, and I, I just enjoyed it for what it was, but, you know, that's just kind of the disappointment there, is that there's no rewards on higher difficulties, kind of a bummer for those who are really good at rhythm games, and, you know, it would be a good way to earn more free orbs, too, just, just saying. Still... I guess that's just one thing. And the other thing that I constantly see people talk about is the new GHB Elite things, which, as you can see, I still need to do the Lloyd um, against the, uh, you know, um, cavalry. So I will do that a little bit later. But several of you sounded off in the comments that uh, it was kind of a bummer that you weren't going to be able to get these on a weekly basis or do these on a weekly basis, at least just to get, you know, these guys right here, the, the actual reruns of the... GHB heroes, which I can kind of get behind. I, I kind of feel, you know, that, that's that's a fine thing, but eventually I, I'm kind of worried about how this is going to play out for those who were, you know, wanting to plus 10 a certain version of these characters, because even if this was weekly, it would still take a very long time for most of these people to actually be able to get a plus 10, because not only is it going to require getting the unit, they're going to be four stars, and then you're going to need to get the uh, EXP, and then, you know, of course, use the feathers that are a part of that. It's it's a whole mess, and that's just to try and merge it up to plus 10, which I'm sure a lot of you are. I know there's some dedicated Narcian fans out there, but... Um, I, I didn't expect them to actually do anything that would be like, oh, hey, here's a weekly GHB free unit, because considering the fact that they haven't done the hero, you know, the normal hero, I'm, when I say hero, I mean this hero rotation, this one all the way down there at the bottom, um, you know, the free units that you can get every day that have not reset for a year themselves, I didn't expect that to happen. 
So it's just kind of how the cookie crumbles, I guess, in this regard. And that really sucks. I was hoping that they would do something like that. It's a little bit disappointing, but not honestly something incredibly disappointing for me. I've just been seeing people going, oh, you know, they can't ever give us this and that. But I, I, I guess, you know, just be happy Xander's back is the big thing I can say. And just be happy that we're going to be able to get these units again. Um, maybe you'll get, you know, a plus three, Z you know, plus four Xander or whatever. Forget how many. Actually, we have a new Infernal mode coming out. So there's going to be two more versions and then that quest, you know, all that fun stuff. Um, you'll get plus five Xander in like a year. That's something, right? guys? <laughs> I don't know, but I just figured the only real thing that I have when it comes to disappointments right now with this update, or at least with that, is the fact I can't get more Divine Dew. I did all the refining quests and I'm still broke, but I did at least complete one thing out of this list. And that, of course, is I finally d just finished off Ninian. So there she is. <laughs> I need to get her set up. She's uh, I think she's actually. Yep, she's paired up with Noe. Probably not the best. I should have probably went with something else anyways, but still, you know, I went through all of that and I still don't have enough Divine Dew to do anything. So I'm like three, uh, I'm, I'm like 20 off, I think, because, you know, that's just fun. And I really want to get Sheeta done. Damn it all. I guess I'll have to wait for that arena to be done. Mm. <laughs> uh, so I just want to see what you guys, where you guys are in all of this, where you stand on this update. Did you like it? Do you like the new game mode? What is it? So, uh, tell me, I, I want to see what you guys say and, uh, hope you have a wonderful evening and everything guys for now though, I will catch y'all later. See you all very soon. Bye.